if Netflix pulls back quite a bit, you know, that could be a, um, a good call trade if we can have it sink in with the S&P. So that's what I'm looking for over here today. So once again, I want to say that, uh, you know, if we go down 20 percent, I want to add two more contracts to this uh, to cost average, uh, you know, the situation there. All right. That was a major move by the S&P. Let's just keep an eye out on our position because if it goes down by 20 percent, then I want to. So if it goes down by four hundred dollars, then I want to add those two contracts there. So here you can see again, this bar has higher volume than the open. So as of now, it looks like that is a lot of buying there. That was a big move on the S&P. Looks like that was mostly all buying. Uh, the volume is very high on the S&P. It looks like it was buying. So we are in the trade. So I'm just going to pause it and uh, just watch the charts. So let's just take a look at where we are. It's still down about $200. It's not quite enough to uh, double down. Now it's only down about 170. So let's just keep it right there. I don't want to simply double down when uh, it's not gone down enough. So I'm just going to leave it there. OK, Netflix moves into uh, very bullish. That's good. 351. So let's just take a quick look. Uh, OK, we are up now. OK, that's not bad. So that's a good sign Let we still keep it on Netflix and see see what it is. 352. And let's see what we have on Netflix right now. All right. So now we are getting somewhere. It's about $200 up and let's just watch the charts and uh, try to see how, uh, how best we can deal with this. OK, so now it's gone past 353.1. Let's see our position 168 up. Let's continue to watch it. So what do we have? We have a $2,200 trade here. Uh, let's just continue to watch it. See if we can get about uh, 15, 20 percent. If we can, then I'll just take the trade off because uh, it does show a topping out kind of a sign here. And Netflix is uh, well, I'm confident that we are still up on a bullish trend here with both the S&P as well as uh, uh, Netflix. We need to have these things recalculate here. ES is still trying to punch through that 2600 convince. Yeah, there you go. Now that's a convincing breakthrough of uh, a big round number. Uh, it went there. And so here, let's see what our position is on Netflix. Uh, we are up about 218, 233. So and Netflix is punching up. Uh, let's see, 278, 300. I'm at peel off one contract and uh, give it a slightly higher limit order. So here we are at 850, uh, 845, and it's at 354.5. So it's still going higher. So let's let's peel off one contract. Take it off. All right. There we go. 860. Yeah, we should have got uh, we should have got the good price. And uh, so now we've booked some profit, just a partial profit. If it shows any signs of weakness now, I will take the trade off because it's not uh, it's not worth uh, keeping it on for more time because these things change. I mean, these are day trading signals. And so uh, on one bar, you could just give up all your profit. And so, you know, you don't want that. Right, let me see. Where is Netflix right there? It's crossing 355 now. That's great. 326 still stalling a little bit. I say I'll take one more contract. So at least you'd have booked quite a bit of profit out of this position. So OK, there it is. It it, uh, it went there and I think we got a good price 8.9, I suppose. And uh, let's see. So we are left with one contract, but certainly not a not a bad exit at all. What do we have? 357. I'll tell you what. Let's just take it 871. OK, 850. No, we didn't. It gave us just the 850 exactly $350 up, which would be about 15 percent on Netflix on a three contract position. So if you want a free trial of this day trading signal service, you can go to this bit.ly link. It's bit.ly uh, slash day hyphen signals. Now the day and the, uh, the D and the S has to be capitals. And once you go there, you can get a free trial. You can, you'll need to sign up there and you'll get a free trial. And uh, at the end of one week, if you don't want to continue, you can just send us an email at info at option tiger.com and we'll give you a full refund. So once again, the bit.ly link is bit.ly slash day hyphen signals with the DNS in caps. Thank you.